see. How do you pull a performance of Chris Brown and Ciara? They gave an award to Chris Brown for best R&B artist. He's one of the greatest, if not the greatest, entertainer living in the world today. And the tribute they would have done to Michael Jackson, the greatest performer who ever lived, would have been epic. It's what people wanted to see. So, so what's ABC thinking? They're canceling black music, or they think, okay, they put our friend Lionel Richie on, but they're not putting on Chris and Ciara. They should be ashamed of themselves. And especially since it's a tribute to the 40th anniversary of Thriller, the biggest selling album and the greatest album of all time. Instead, ABC did what? Now, maybe Disney should stick to cartoons. They, they, perhaps they don't belong in the music business. Why I agree with John that Chris is an amazing entertainer and of this generation, one of the best performers and singers. And he would have done justice to a Michael Jackson performance. And as well as Sierra, she's one of the most underrated dancers and singers out there. Um, doesn't get the spotlight that, um, say, Rihanna and Beyonce does, but she is an amazing dancer and performer. So I agree with John that it was a shame that ABC and Disney cancelled the performance in honor of Michael Jackson's Thrill album, which is celebrating 40 years, biggest selling album in the world. My concern then becomes that he's saying that they did this because they don't like black music and it might have some racial undertones. That becomes a concern. So some of us were thinking that maybe the Michael Jackson estate went didn't sign off on Chris uh, performing, and it can see by John, who is the executor, executor of the Michael Jackson estate, um, and he's been a, a, a long-term industry music executive. In fact, he's one assigned Janet Jackson to A&M Records. So while it seems as if the Michael Jackson estate were fine with the performance, they signed off on it, Chris Brown and Sierra were ready for it, there's been no word from ABC or their parent company, Disney, as to why they pulled the plug on Chris Brown. So we're going to keep checking this. Hopefully we'll get a, a statement soon. But I, I, I just hope that it doesn't overshadow the fact that we're celebrating Michael's Thrill album, 40 years. We, uh, we would have been great to see Chris and Sierra perform. So guys, let me know what you think. Do you think he's overstepped the mark by trying to impl imply that there may be elements of racism? Or do you think he might have some truth to it? Or do you think it's a shame we missed it? But hopefully we'll get to see them perform um, on another show. Thanks for watching. Please remember to subscribe to the channel, but most importantly, to press the notification bell so that you can be notified when we do have a new interview. Loads to come, but thanks a lot for watching.